We have some breaking news right now. A man sentenced to 24 years to life for that brutal attack on a teenager. The girl bravely fighting back. Last year, Xavier McDaniel broke into the Littleton apartment as the 15-year-old was home alone. 7 News reporter Tyler Lopez just stepping out of the Jefferson County courtroom. Tyler. And Kelly, an emotional day in court today. The victim's mother reading a statement telling the defendant that he has not broken her daughter. The, def the victim herself, a teenage girl, did have a statement read for her by a Jefferson County Sheriff's deputy. And she said she still has flashbacks and that she's scared of things she shouldn't be scared of. Despite the fact that he's been convicted and that today was sentencing, both his attorney and the defendant, though, maintain his innocence. It happened at an apartment complex near Bowles and Sims on April 4th of last year. The 15-year-old girl would have a fractured tooth, a serious head injury. Her blood would be found throughout the apartment as if she'd been dragged room to room. The defendant, Xavier McDaniel, maintains he's innocent. He spoke in court today saying, I've been bashed for a year now for something I haven't done. I understand I put myself in a bad situation and therefore I accept part of the blame. The judge didn't buy that, saying the victim's injuries couldn't just happen. She also noted violent rape porn on his phone, and they had an apparent interest in chloroform also noted on his phone. The judge saying, I can only think that you were planning for the next victim, so they could not resist you. Repeatedly, the victim in this case prays for her heroism. The defendant, Xavier McDaniel, in the end, sentenced to 24 years to life. His attorneys, though, say he'll appeal. And his family repeatedly told the judge he was raised as a respectful young man. The judge said she believed that, saying that what he's convicted of doing makes it all the more puzzling. Live in Jefferson County this afternoon, Tyler Lopez, 7 News.